Today we're going to be taking a look at the best gooseneck hitch options for your 2010 Ram 3500. Please check our fit guide for your specific application. So here we have your best gooseneck options. Here we're going to have our B&W and that's going to be the turnover ball underbed gooseneck trailer hitch part number BWGNRK1313. Now here we have the draw tight fold down gooseneck trailer hitch and that's going to be part number 8339-4435. And finally on the bottom here we have the draw tight hide a goose underbed gooseneck trailer hitch part number 9464. Dash three eight. Now each one of our kits here is going to give us the same end result. They're going to allow us to tow a gooseneck trailer with our vehicle. And now we can get a little bit closer look, look at some of the similarities and some of the differences. Now one of the main differences between all our hitches here is our B&W and our draw tight Hida Goose are both going to install and have the same end result being under the bed, whereas our draw tight fold down is going to be above our bed. Now both underbed kits, all we're going to see in our bed is the ball and our safety chain loop sticking out. Now the draw tight fold down is going to be a little bit different. We're going to have this plate sticking out and it's going to be sitting in our bed. Now the only thing really protruding out is going to be the ball, but we are going to have this plate exposed. Now because of the way they're designed, they're each going to operate a little bit differently. Now right now our ball's in the locked position so we're not able to remove it or anything else but if we come to this handle right here which would be sticking out on your wheel well if we pull the handle out slightly rotate it it'll lock the handle in place and disengage the mechanism holding our ball in we can remove our ball and actually if we want to to save space we'll turn it over and we stow it in the truck and now we have a nice flush surface giving us full access to our bed. Now the draw tight hide goose here is going to work in a very similar fashion. If we come to our handle over here, again it's going to be on our driver's side wheel well. If we pull the handle out, we can move it either direction, whether it be forward or backwards. We're going to unlock our ball and we can turn it over and put it in there so we can store it. And the draw tight actually comes with a nice magnetic cover. So when our ball is stored, we're gonna have a nice plug to keep all the debris out. Now the draw tight fold down here in the center, it's gonna work a little differently. We don't have a handle at all on our driver's side or the passenger side. Instead, in the center here, we have this ring. And if we pull up on our ring, we can actually fold the ball down, put our plate back down and our ball can be stowed away, still giving us access to our bed. Now each one of our goosenecks does feature a 2 and 5 16 ball, but they all have slight differences to them. The BMW turnover ball here, the nice thing about this is, is the finish looks a little bit different than a standard chrome ball, and that's because it's anodized, and as you can see it has a square shank, which is going to help reduce all the rattle and noise, and it's also going to make sure that when you're hooking up to your trailer, it's not going to turn when you're going to hook up. Now our fold down here also has a two and five sixteenths ball, but this one is gonna have a chrome finish on it, as well as it's permanently attached and we're not gonna be able to remove it, but we still can stow it away. Finally here, our Hida Goose, it does have a, a nice chrome finish on the ball as well, but as you can see, it has a round shank. Now to make sure it doesn't move while it's inside of here, there's a small notch right here inside of our tube, as well as a notch in the ball, so you can't put the ball in incorrectly, and that way it keeps it nice and secure and it's not gonna turn around and move on you. Now as far as weight capacity goes, our B&W turnover ball here is gonna have a 30,000 pound gross trailer weight rating, and the vertical load limit is gonna be 7,500 pounds. Now our draw tight fold down gooseneck is gonna have a 25,000 pound gross trailer weight rating, and a 6,250 pound vertical load limit. Finally, our draw tight Hida Goose here is gonna have a 30,000 pound gross trailer weight rating and a 7,500 pound vertical load limit. Now, I do wanna mention that all of these weight ratings are for the hitch and you wanna double check with your vehicle's owner's manual to make sure it can handle those capacities. They're all gonna install relatively the same with the exception 
of our fold down gooseneck right here. With our fold down gooseneck here, we are gonna have to cut a rather large section out. Not the entire plate here, but the rather large section that we're gonna have to cut out of our bed. But the rest of our kit's gonna go in relatively the same. We're gonna have two cross members underneath our bed and two bars connecting them on each side of our frame. Our B&W turnover ball, that's gonna be relatively the same as far as the crossbars and frame brackets. But here in the middle, since this is all gonna be under the bed, we're only gonna have to cut one large hole in the center for our ball to come out, as well as our safety chain loops. And the Heidi Goose is gonna be relatively the same with just cutting one large hole, as well as the safety chain loops, and our brackets gonna install the same. Now one of the really big benefits with our draw tight Heidi Goose and our B&W turnover ball is the versatility that you get when you get them. Not only do you get a gooseneck hitch that you can tow your gooseneck trailer with, but there is adapters available for both the draw tight and the B&W to convert your gooseneck into a fifth wheel. Or with the B&W, there is a ladder rack that'll leave the side rails of your bed fully open. To sum everything up, as far as weight capacity goes, I'm gonna have to give it to our underbed kits, the B&W and the draw tight Heide Goose because of the 30,000 gross trailer weight rating and the 7,500 pound vertical load limit. Now, as far as fit and finish goes, I think I'm gonna give it to the B&W because experience with installing all three of these kits, it does fit very nicely and it gives you that nice clean look in the bed. Now, when it comes to versatility, I think the draw tight Heide Goose and the B&W again are gonna take into this category simply because of the available options and accessories you can get for them. As far as ease of installation goes, I'm gonna give it to the B&W here because after installing all three of these, I felt that it was the easiest to install as well as accessing all our bolts and torquing everything down. And that'll finish up the look at the best gooseneck hitch options for your Ram 3500.